Not too big, not too small, just right for me. Understanding dwarfism. Hi, my name is Sam. I am six years old, and my favorite color is orange. You might notice something different about me. No, silly, not my hair. This is my friend Miguel. We are both six years old. Can you see my difference now? That is right. I am much shorter than Miguel, and that is what makes me awesome. All of my friends are different in some way. Tommy wears glasses. Allison has big hair. Ben is big. Tim is tall. Jen uses a wheelchair to get around. Grace thinks a little longer. I am short. Miguel's skin color is different from George's. We are all different in our own way, and that is what makes us all awesome. If we were all the same, that. Would be boring. Being different in some way is the only thing that really makes us all the same. What makes you different from everyone else? Is it the way you look, the way you act, how you speak, where you live, who you are? Let's see what makes you different. I have dwarfism. Which makes me shorter than others. That is because my bones do not grow the same way as some of my friends. Do you know why? Because inside of our bodies, we have what is called DNA. It is kind of like blueprints, which are used as instructions on how to build a house. DNA is in charge of telling us how tall. Or short we are, it tells us the color of our skin and the color of our eyes. It also tells our body how to work, from the beating of our hearts to the way our bones grow. DNA is our blueprints for how we are made and for who we are. It creates the differences that make us all special in our own way. Dwarfism makes me shorter and is only part of who I am. Otherwise, I am just another kid, just like you. I can do just about anything everyone else can, but because I am much shorter, sometimes I have to do things in a different way. No matter what it is, one way or another, I get it done. If I ride a bicycle, it is smaller to fit my size. Sometimes I need to use a step stool to get things. Sometimes I need to use a stick to reach things. Sometimes I need to use a stick and my step stool to reach something. If I do not have a step stool or a stick and I can't reach something, I ask someone for help. You should not. Point or stare at anyone, or call them names, because it can hurt their feelings and make them sad. Do you like to have your feelings hurt or feel sad? You should call people by their name. If you do not know their name, you can always ask them. If you need to describe me to someone, you can always say, "That is Sam. He has dwarfism." Or the boy with dwarfism, or the boy who is much shorter. Always remember that just because you are taller, it does not mean that you are older, and just because someone is shorter, it does not mean that they are a baby, or that you should call them a baby. Only a baby would think that or say that. George is ten years old, and his grandpa is eighty years old. Who is taller and who is older? My name is Sam, and dwarfism is only part of who I am. I am not too big. I am not too small. 
I am just right for me. Celebrate your difference. I am just right for me.